know what I mean? I'll be 78 <laughs> on my birthday. 78. 78. You've been around for a spell, little mm -hmm. one. And in a good way. Yeah. You've been around for a spell. You've seen some things. Oh, yeah. yeah. So I'm sure some of the things that you're about to say to us today are only going to be fact and knowledgeable because you do have the experience and expertise. Oh, no doubt. No doubt. I'm going to do it all. I thought they liked Magic the Gathering. I have no idea. Everything's, everything's, everything's problematic. Everyone's getting canceled. It's amazing how many people did blackface. Yeah, it's very strange. It's very strange. <laughs> it's, right? Yeah, a bunch of times. Yeah, I mean, like, in the modern world. Oh, right on TV. Jimmy Fallon was doing, well, he's doing a Chris Rock impression, which, he, by the way, he used to be able to do. When I was in high school, my friends were Mr. T for Halloween. Nobody gave a fuck. Nobody was like, Jimmy, what's wrong with you? <laughs> but it's like, oh, you're Mr. T for Halloween. It was never, like, a problem. It's, very, it's a very strange thing, you know? Like, you can do And saw your mom in this situation and did this to your dad. Right, like this is real conversations, but we don't we don't have them, and not only we don't have them, it seems like it seems like there's forces that are actively trying to prevent us from talking to each other, from sitting down at a table and saying, "Hey, man, what? Tell me what's going on. What forces? Who wants who wants the country to be divided? It's the people that we were talking about earlier that that how they score points." How do I score points with this group? How do I sp score points with the other group? It's by making making everything is different. It's, it's horrible to watch, man. It's sickening to watch. I was reading a, a whole series of tweets where the journalist that was talking about how um, cops shooting black men is a real problem, but another real problem that's not being discussed by this Black Lives Matter, I'm going to get, you know, make... I'm gonna work really hard and really not, uh, I'm gonna pay cap on how much money I make. There's all kinds of reasons why becoming a politician doesn't look like the best job for, for most people that would look and say, hey, would I rather be the CEO of a company and make a ton of money and make, create a huge product and leave a big impact and influence thousands of people that work at my company in a positive way? Or would I rather go and get ridiculed? Complete and utter chaos in America. I mean, way, way beyond, um, beyond where we're at. Have right you thought now. about this? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I'm telling you what I think. When, yeah. when, because people ask, no, you should do this, you should do that. I say, um, you know, we're not at a point where we need this. We might of, be about four days away from we it. We could be. <laughs> I think the answer, you know, let's get let's get uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. I agree with you. He's, he's the guy that could really, I think, unify people. And I think he would have to run as an independent. And I recommend he does it right now. Right, right now. He should be like, yeah, you know what? I'm in. I, mean, I think he would win. I think he would win. I really think the streets to vote for you. Yeah, you don't have the machine behind you. You don't have the DNC behind you or the Republican Party. Yeah, it's um, it's a real weird situation we find ourselves in with no clear path to sanity. Now, there's no clear path to sanity if we don't talk to each other. And right now we're not. Yeah, we're not. I've seen, uh, you know, the people are so just angry a just angry when you talk to him about this stuff and just anger comes out it's hard it's horrible to watch yeah what, what disturbs me and that i don't see in, I mean, in the past when there's been disputes or things have been wrong it seems like there's a, a it seems stressful for anybody except trump for whatever fucking reason that guy eats it up but for most people running for president alone, just the grueling, just the, the schedule that's involved and traveling and doing all these speeches and it, it just breaks them down. I mean, one of the reasons why Hillary lost was she just wasn't willing to travel as much. Most definitely, open bar. Uh, it even so much, they came back. Listen, bring Fox. <laughs> bring Fox. <laughs> Listen, this is a family affair. Yeah. Oh, you have eight kids. I just had a new one. Mm -hmm. You're done with kids, you try to catch me with kids. No. You I mean, I mean, it's, yeah, I'm, I'm done. It ain't seen. I think mean, people should realize is how to make cannon before they cut. <laughs> it was future before future. Yeah, you were. I just, I, I don't, sometimes 
I don't get upset. But I'm like, why don't they ever lump me in? But I'm so active with mine. Right. You see me with mine all the time. All of them. When we go somewhere, we all boys. One little listen. I need to see. What did you do in high school? Did you share? Did you play volleyball? Did you run track? Like, did you do all the right legs? Do you have footage of, of, of anything? Then I, you check the ankles. No, listen. No, you laughing. I'm laughing. Listen. The most important foundation in any sport you play is your your footwork. Yeah. Okay. If he ain't got the foundation and has the problem, I mean, some you gotta be right. You can't have cables. Then you got, you got men these days. You go out, you go out to these beautiful women. Yeah. You go on dates to these women. People say the thing that kids are expensive. Well, I think it's what you choose to buy. Right? Because there's different variations of everything, and I just pick the cheapest one. Right. Until the child knows the difference between the two. By that time, they're old enough to work and get it for themselves.